Hey guys and welcome to another video in the No Hands Proxies tutorial video series. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to automatically get the proxies from No Hands Proxies into GSA Search Engine Ranker. Now if you've seen the video on how to use the output um, options in No Hands Proxies or you've seen the video on how to get the proxies from No Hands Proxies into No Hands SEO, you'll have already seen half of the, um, the bits that are needed to perform this. So I'm going to quickly gloss over the controls in No Hands Proxies that you're going to need to set before touching on uh, GSA Search Engine Ranker. So I'll get No Hands Proxies up. Now you'll see it's been running for about an hour now. Um, it's found around a thousand proxies, but obviously not all of them will have passed the, the Google um, check-in. But I'm going to show you how to get it all set up first. So we'll go to the settings and in here we need to first set up the output options. Now I've got this set to output the proxies every one minute. That's just so that you've got the most up-to-date, um, freshest proxy list uh, possible. So I've chosen to output proxies every one minute and then I need to check the option to output proxy list to a local file. Now it wants to be in the .txt file. So from there we need to click the browse button and choose where you want the file to be output to. In this, op in this instance I've chosen the no hands proxies folder in the, the my documents folder and uh, I've called the file output. Okay, that's all you need to do. Um, it's very easy. Now in the proxy testing settings I'm going to check Google so that every working proxy found will be checked against Google just to make sure that it is usable for searching. Okay that's all you need to do is you, you save the, the settings there and then from that point on all of the, the working proxies that have been checked and passed in Google will be output to the file uh, ready to be loaded into GSA. So that's all set up you can leave that running in the background and that will get you your proxies now I'm going to go into GSA now this hasn't been set up already so I'm going to go into the out uh, sorry the options now in here in the submission tab we want to be setting up the the proxy settings down here first you'll need to check the use proxies option then all of these options will become available now you want to tick the search engines box and public because you want to be using your public proxies for that. Now submissions generally I'd, I'd suggest to use private proxies or no proxies um, for that just because public proxies generally aren't nearly as reliable as a private proxy or your own internet connection so um, generally I'd, I'd advise ticking the private option or using no proxies at all but that's entirely up to you if you have no proxies and you're using no hands proxies as your primary proxy source and you want to use those for hiding your own IP address then by all means you'd be checking the the public option there and for PR checking if you check in if you're limiting by PR then you want to be checking the PR checking box and the the public option there. Now I wouldn't advise doing the verification with the proxies because obviously if your proxies are not that reliable, which public proxies tend not to be uh, particularly reliable, um, if a proxy is down when it uses the, the when it goes to do the verification it's not going to be able to find that link so generally you're better off not using proxies for verification. Now from there what you'll need to do is go to configure now from here you'll want to go into add slash edit proxy sites. Um, you want to uncheck all all of the um, all of the, the proxy sources that you don't want to be using, which if you're already using a, a proxy harvester such as No Hands Proxies, you don't want GSA to be doing any harvesting because obviously all of GSA's um, users will be using those proxy sources as well so you'd be better off un or deselecting all of those options and then adding in your own proxy source which will be the file but first you need to sorry first you need to click on the add and then go to single and then in here now it, as far as I can see it doesn't allow you to just enter in the the file location so what we have to do is put in a fake um, URL so in this case I'm going to put um, proxyfile.com I don't know why 
that has to be the case but so for proxyfile.com we can now change the change it from parse URL to parse file and then with the the arrow here we can click that and you see it opens up the the usual windows load file or open file um, interface and then you just choose the out, the file that you've chosen to output the proxies to you select that and then that's put that in there for you and then you click OK. Now here you can you need to click add and then find proxies online and then you'll see it loads up all the proxies from the file. See it's found 79 oops see it's found 79 um, proxies so that's what you can use for, for running GSA with. So I know it's not quite as simple as uh, in other tools where you can just select the file and have it it load up and handle it all for you but that's how you would load in the proxies uh, from no hands proxies into GSA search engine ranker okay now I have to admit I don't use uh, the search engine ranker that often so if I have got anything wrong or I've um, explained things in in a roundabout fashion or I've gone about things in a way that isn't ideal then by all means uh, get in touch with me or post a comment and tell me that I'm a, a bonehead and I've done something wrong and I'll do my best to, to get it updated with the, the correct information or uh, if you have any questions you can post a comment or you can go over to the support forum at nohandsseo.com forward slash forum you can post in there um, try to post into the no hands proxies support forum so that obviously it's in the right place and it gets noticed correctly. Um, alternatively you can always email me at nohandsseo sorry support at nohandsseo.com or support at nohandsproxies.com or you can use the contact form on the 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 website at nohandsproxies.com. Okay, thanks for watching and I hope to hear from you soon. Cheers.